bought a new truck here recently, you may have seen on the channel that we're going to use with our e-commerce business around the shop and for things like that. And it's, uh, it's a heavy duty three quarter ton, which is a pretty good upgrade from the half ton I was using. However, the receiver hitch on the back is now much higher off the ground. It's also a different size. It's two and a half as opposed to the two inch head on the half ton truck. So I need another hitch. Got one here I bought locally. I'm going to show you the features of it coming up. I'm Roger walking to the shop and I'm covering this is not sponsored at all I, I bought this actually I bought it locally at a uh, store called Farm and Fleet which we have here in this area and it was on sale and I got it cheaper there than I could even get it on Amazon comes in two different sizes either for a two inch receiver for a two and a half mine's two and a half I got a two and a half inch kit it's made by Uriah and has a heap of features and if you're old like me you may have just caught the reference about Uriah Heap which was a rock band from the late 60s, early 70s. Never heard of it. Look it up. It's pretty good rock music from back in the day. But we're going to get on to the hitch here. I'll show you what's in this box and what I like about this. Okay, aside from the fact it comes in a really nice case, I used to have to carry my other hitches in a canvas bag. This is nice. This is a high strength aluminum. Of course, this is a two and a half inch receiver in, which will go into the receiver. But I have all of these adjustments here for drop. This will either do an 8 inch drop or an 8 inch rise. And the way my truck sits, I don't need the rise. I need the drop. And then attaching to this, you have three different balls. You've got the inch and 7 eighths. You've got the 2 inch. And you've got the 2 and 5 sixteenths. I knew it was something like that. I don't have anything that needs that, but you never know when something might come along. And you have various pins and everything to hold everything together. I don't have all the uh, clips in it right now. But these pins drop in from back here. And once this is against this, these pins cannot come out. So we have this mounted here into the receiver. It's kind of hard to do with one. And you slide this up and put your pin in where you need it. I'll just use one of these for right now. It does come with some locking pins. Those pins that are holding the hitch balls absolutely cannot come out. So it's very, very easy to swap them around. Now, as I mentioned here, it comes with some locking hitch pins and keys. And these have some weatherproof covers on to keep water out. I don't know how well they'll keep water out, but around here in Illinois, you cannot run around with a hitch hanging out of the back of your truck in some areas because you can get a ticket for that and it's a moving violation. So I wouldn't leave this in there anyway uh, because it's a shin kicker. I hate running into the hitches. And of course it all goes right back into the case just like that. It does come with a little instruction thing here. I'm just going to kind of leave that in there and keep it. Just like that. And it's got a good storage. So how much was this? Uh, as I recall, it was like $169. I thought that was a pretty good value, and it was cheaper than uh, what I had found on Amazon. I was looking at this on Amazon and a few other places, and just happened to see in a sale paper at uh, Farm and Fleet there they were running a sale. Of course, that sale's over now, but I think this is a pretty good hitch. Have I towed anything with it yet? No. But I have played with it and put it on the truck, and it, checked it out for the different heights because I have different types of trailers. Uh, of course we got the great big pontoon boat and then I've got uh, a couple utility trailers uh, so yeah it's going to be real handy for that. So once again not a paid promotion or anything I just kind of wanted to talk about this because I thought this Uriah Hitch had a heap of features. There's that reference again. So if you got anything out of this appreciate getting a thumbs up always helps the channel. Roger in the shop. Thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one.